This is Sloan the Thought Slayer. It is a story about overcoming fears using CP, the CBT, so cognitive behavioral therapy. And so it's a two for one. It is a story. And then at the end of the book on the back cover is a game. And here's what the game board looks like. So in the story, a little boy is having a very difficult time going to sleep at night because the monsters are creeping up on him. So there's a thunderstorm outside and the monster's creeping up on him. He's freaking out and he decides I'm sick and tired of living this way. I'm going to put together a plan to overcome my fears so that I don't have to worry about monsters anymore. And so he seeks counsel from his dad and his dad tells him it's your thoughts that are bothering you. It's not the monsters. And if you want to feel better, you're going to have to learn how to overcome those thoughts. And so he's like, you know what? I'm going to put on some armor. I am going to go to bed prepared and ready to go. So he goes around and he starts making armor and um, he gets all these different pieces together to help him remember that he is safe. And so each armor represents something um, about, you know, having family support, being able to control his thoughts, um, like the, the sword that he picks up is truth. And the way you defeat these lying thoughts is by speaking truth to them. So as he presents the truth, um, the thoughts have to, you know, the, the thoughts of monsters have to leave whenever he says monsters aren't real and they can't hurt me. And so that night he goes to bed and he has his armor on. So he is ready to go and he's ready to overcome these fears. And so, and the monsters don't bother him anymore because he, he has learned how to defeat them. And then, so we've got four pages of cards. And so there's like, I don't know if you can see those pictures very well. There's um, two different types of cards on each page. And so this game board will have different pictures on it. And so each picture kind of covers different pieces of the armor, um, support from dad. And so you start up here at the monster and then you end when you get to the castle. And so it's just like the, all the questions are about how do you use these cognitive behavioral skills to overcome fears? And so the, uh, the game just really drives home the point. And so what I like about these books is it introduces the idea and it kind of explains how the process works. So by the time you get to the game, you have a, a, a decent understanding of how to use the cognitive behavioral skills. So it's, it's a nice little introduction to it. And, um, and so it just teaches those, those basic skills to help stop intrusive thoughts, replace them with something calming and to um, speak truth over these lying irrational thoughts to shut them down. And so I have had a lot of success with kids being able to shut down scary thoughts at night using these cognitive behavioral skills. And so this stuff really works, but it is a whole lot more fun whenever you have a book and a game to go with it. So this one is available um, in hard copy.